off because they're doing a nice little intro for this final heat. Section 12 out of 12. And this heat is what we will be the considerably, supposed to be considerably fastest heat of the day. That's Union Catholic right there. Now I gotta, I gotta brag on Union Catholic a little bit. They're home to Sydney McLaughlin from New Jersey. Yeah. Oh. But Bullish Track Club is right after them with a nice little introduction out of Michigan. Bullish Track Club has had athletes after athletes. Such an amazing program. And then last but not least, McNera Mustangs. What a name, the Mustangs for track and field. I am excited to Me watch too. this one because I just know we should see some fast times produced out of this. They want to run faster than a 328.38. And look at those stands. Still packed. Stands are super packed. You see the stands are actually standing for this heat. Including us. Including us. <laughs> <laughs> Section 12 out of 12. And once again, for those lane assignments, it's Patriot Track Club in lane two. Dematha Catholic in lane three. Union Catholic in lane four. Bullish Track Club in lane five. McNair Mustangs in lane six. Now the fastest seed on paper is Bullish with 323. No surprise. Yeah, right out of Michigan. Now the meet record is 327. So, ooh, yeah. yeah. So we yeah, might yeah. see that meet record go down. These boys are in their blocks. And that lead off leg from Bullish Track Club, that's Matthew Goins. But up there in lane six, oh. that's Mason Samuels. Trying not to get caught. Bullish Track Club has pulled up. He is grabbing his hamstring, but he's going to try to finish. But we got to keep on moving right along here. The Mustangs have handed off in first. Looks like we had a fall there, too, from Union Catholic. So much going on. And again, another dramatic heat going on. Looks like Bullish Track Club will be out. I do not see them anymore. Their first leg pulled up, holding his leg. But Union Catholic, we got to talk about them. They are in the lead right now as they just hand it off to their second 200 meter runner. It's unfortunately TC out of Bullis. High expectations for them. We've got one lap to go for the four. And that looks like the Mustangs, he decided to come up in the inside, but that's because Union Catholic they gave let him. him the room. Yeah, he gave him the room. You cannot give them the room. The Mustangs now has the advantage because he is in the inside and he will probably pass off first now. You always want them to have to work to take over. You don't ever want somebody to cut in on the inside. You want to make them have to work and go around you on the outside. Absolutely. Absolutely. And he is regretting it as he just handed off that baton. We see him in the infield. But now they are still one into the Mustangs and Union Catholic. This is the final heat of this championship sprint medley relay. That's McNamara Mustangs up there getting all of the company from Union Catholic sitting right there on his toes. And that's always a scary part because you're not, you're not too sure how the other 800 runner is going to run. Are they going to be technical about yeah. this? Yeah. Do they have a strong finish? Mm -hmm. What's going to happen? Are you just being strategic? Are you sitting back there because you don't have the kick? Exactly. Are you sitting back there because you know you have the kick? Exactly. 
but we're just going to see if the Mustang's kick can be stronger. You want to kick, I'm going to kick too. Right. <laughs> True. And they're going to be coming off this curb, going into their bell lap. And you're going to see these boys really start to kick. The crowd is going crazy. The Mustangs, he's kicking. Union Catholic going right with them. There's still time to pass. See, he has swung out now to lane two. He may have used that energy a little bit too soon because now he's on the final curve. He's going to try to use the bank to his advantage. You see the lights now as they are going from under that New Balance bridge. Union Catholic trying to push the Mustangs is falling apart. Wow, Union Catholic will get that one. 329 16. They're going Three, crazy. 29 15. But you know what is absolutely amazing? The Golden Eagles still have that number one time out of man. Heat two. So they will actually take the win at the end of the day today for the championship boys sprint medley. That is so crazy this is what happens when they are timed finals you never know who you're going to get you assume that it's all the fastest guys but you can see union catholic he wrapped around he said those fireworks are exactly what i needed exactly added that little bit of adrenaline to get him going and he said i am here to fight for my team I can't help but wish that the Golden Eagles had an opportunity to run. To run, race. The Golden Eagles also bullish track club. You know, prayers up to that athlete. Absolutely. Ended up dropping out in the first 200. He was holding his leg. It's unfortunate then because we wanted to see them race, but definitely hoping that the athlete is okay. And coming underway. There's the full results. Golden Eagles, 328, taking that win, like you said, Jasmine. Union Catholic Track Club sitting in second with Silver, 329-15. Third, the Mustangs, 329-26. And now following that championship boy sprint medley, of course, we have to go and follow up with the girl sprint medley.